Patrick, this has been an incredibly difficult time for me and my family. As many of you know, Brittany and I have decided to get a divorce after five years of marriage. It's not a decision we made lightly, and it's been extremely painful. But I feel it's important to share my side of the story, to provide some much-needed context and clarity around what led us to this point. Patrick Mahomes and Brittany Matthews seemed to have the perfect life. High school sweethearts, who got married in 2018 and welcomed a daughter in 2020, they were the picture of marital bliss. Patrick was at the height of his career, leading the Kansas City Chiefs to a Super Bowl victory in 2019 and cementing his status as one of the NFL's premier quarterbacks. By all appearances, they had it all. Patrick. But behind the scenes, Brittany and I have been struggling for a while now. The pressures of my career. The intense scrutiny we faced in the public eye and some deep-seated personal differences all took a major toll on our relationship. We tried for years to make it work, to get to the root of our problems through counseling and open communication. But in the end, we just couldn't reconcile those fundamental differences. It was a shock to fans when news of the Mahomes divorce broke earlier this year. Rumors had been swirling for months, but the couple had remained tight-lipped, trying to protect their privacy during this difficult time. That is, until Patrick decided to open up about what really led to the end of his marriage. Patrick, I want to be clear, this wasn't about me finding someone else or Brittany finding someone else. There was no infidelity, no major betrayal. It was simply a case of two people who loved each other deeply, but just couldn't overcome some deep-rooted issues in our relationship. And those issues came to a head in a way that left us with no choice but to go our separate ways. One of the biggest factors was the immense pressure and stress that came with my football career. The constant media attention, the intense scrutiny, the demands on my time and energy, it all put an unbelievable strain on our marriage. Brittany and I both struggled to maintain a sense of normalcy and work-life balance. We fought constantly about my long hours, my commitment to the game, and the lack of quality time we got to spend together as a family. Patrick. And then there were the differences in our personalities and our fundamental values. Brittany is a very strong-willed, independent woman who has her own ambitions and goals. I respect that so much about her. But at times, it created conflict because I'm a more traditional, old-school kind of guy who believes the man should be the primary breadwinner and decision-maker in the family. We just didn't see eye to eye on a lot of those core relationship dynamics. Those differences came to a head in recent years, with the couple reportedly engaging in explosive fights and arguments that left them both feeling incredibly unhappy and unfulfilled in the marriage. Things finally came to a breaking point last year, leading Patrick and Brittany to make the difficult decision to file for divorce. Patrick, it wasn't an easy choice by any means. Brittany is the love of my life and walking away from our marriage was one of the hardest things I've ever had to do. But I reached a point where I knew, for both of our sakes, and for the sake of our daughter, that divorce was the healthiest path forward. I still care deeply for Brittany, and I know she feels the same way about me. But we just weren't able to reconcile those fundamental differences, and continuing to try would have only led to more pain and resentment. So that's why I made the decision to sign those divorce papers. It was the hardest thing I've ever done, but I knew it was necessary. Brittany deserves to be with someone who is truly compatible with her. And I deserve to find that kind of partnership as well. I hope that by sharing my story, I can provide some clarity and help other couples who may be struggling with similar issues in their relationships. Divorce is never an easy path, but sometimes it's the healthiest choice you can make. I'm grateful for the time Brittany and I had together, and I wish her nothing but the best moving forward. This isn't the ending I hoped for. But I'm hopeful that it's the beginning of a new chapter for both of us.